So, everybody, now we are about to watch episode 7 of Follow Me, the reality show that I was on. I am Jazz for watching. If you guys... Oh, uh, and uh, yeah, let's get it cracking. So, uh, everyone everyone on TikTok, we are live on Twitch. Let's get it cracking! Yeah, boy! Eliminate. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Look how I was sitting there. Look how I was sitting there. Wait, I don't know where to put my, uh, I don't know where to put me. I should go, like, right up here, probably. Wait, am I, am I there in all the other YouTube videos? I gotta check, yo. Uh, let me see. Um, wait, 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 chat. I need, I need to see how I set it up in these videos. Yo, Liliana, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it, Liliana. Let me, let me look at my account and just see where I'm placed in these videos. Oh, I am bottom left. Okay. <coughs> All right, cool. All right, chat. Here we go. 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 Sorry. I don't mean to edge you guys. This is my first time watching this too, y'all. Eliminate. Are you serious? serious. Here. I just got eliminated, but I'm not going to be a sore loser about it. My dad would probably be upset with me if I was like a sore loser about everything. Text Vince Rossi. Like, All right. You do? Yeah. yeah like, for real. Text Rossi watching the show on stream right now. Now that I'm eliminated, I can focus on winning the brand challenges and getting some money in that aspect. As long as I don't get paired up with Keith. Everybody brought their A game and yeah, no, it was I'm great. fine to go out on that note. Like, okay, that good. Was good. Yeah. good. All my girls. Nobody spoil it. Before. I'm not surprised, to be honest. I wish I was with them. But I'm happy for them. You're giving baby spice. Ah! That's it. Sorry, I just Is realized. That it? Don't do exactly. <laughs> yeah. Love you, Mia Prada. I'm so ready. Here we go. What's my outfit today? Wow, I know everyone is gonna be stepping up their game and then <laughs> Eleanor, Kitty, Hugh, and myself are what up, excellent? high performers and it makes sense that we're in the final four. It's Hell really yeah. cool to have four women in the top four who all have very different perspectives and all bring something totally different to this competition. When I look at my competitors, a combined following, some of them have like 40 times as many followers as I do. So it's just really nice for them to even see me as competition. What do you think you would win in uh, the Follow Me yearbook? Ooh. The kid to say the most whack ass stuff. All right. <laughs> <laughs> most chivalrous. Most chivalrous. What's that? Yeah. Most polite. What's that? I thought chivalry is like chivalry. Chivalry. <laughs> chivalry. <laughs> I think Keith is obnoxious. Keith tries to push my buttons by being overly nice. He's Beats. not genuine. Oh, look at that. We just got a message from Bethany. Why? Where are we going? She said to meet her in... <laughs> I'm not having this shit. Okay. I'm like... <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. You know what's crazy about this chat is that I, I watched Love Island last night with Jake. Jake and I were watching some Love Island, and I was, like, sitting there the whole time watching it, and I was like... Like, I could tell what things, like, the producers came on set and told some of the people, like, say, like, we're going to the fire pit now, or say, can I have a conversation with you? Because when you're doing reality TV, like, you know, they want you to, like, you, you gotta play towards the cameras, like, you're being filmed, you know what I'm saying? Like, so, uh, yeah, okay, whatever. But it's very, it was very funny watching that, and then, like, because I was like, oh, yeah, yeah, I totally, totally get that, like, I'm also, you know, a big reality TV hey, star myself, hey, so I get you guys. it. Hi. Joe, obviously not, but... Elva, Vince, Harrington, and Keith <laughs> have all eliminated at this point. But remember, you are all still eligible to win Look this at my challenge shirt. and the $1,000 in cash. So, it's time to bring it. I don't know about you guys, but I hate having to choose between two things that I love. Well, good news. For this challenge, you can have it all. Because you are going to be working with... Look how me and Vince are standing. <laughs> I remember this one like it was yesterday. I love Twix. It's literally the best candy bar. I'm so excited. It's a cookie and a candy. You can't beat it. <laughs> <laughs> Rossi. In a world of ores. 
cookie and candy, crunchy and chewy, left and right. Yes, Just fans. like the creators I see in front of me who have an original and creative style, Twix is all about not taking life too seriously and having an optimistic outlook all through humor and fun. Hannah, you like so my shirt? Thank you, Hannah. One. That was my custom-made shirt. This week's challenge is someone who knows what it means to go viral. With over 5 billion views Yo, this on kid? social channels in 2023, yeah. JoJo Sim is a leading influencer in the content game. Come on over. Yo, that now. kid, uh, JoJo, is, uh, JoJo and I actually have the same manager. We have the same manager, our guy. Um, so I did the same thing. Yeah. Super to be. We, we, did, we didn't have the same manager at the time, but we, we, we do have the same manager. This, this is a really nice kid. JoJo's a really nice kid. He's smart. JoJo smart kid. is a comedian content creator. And you like my outfits? Thank big you. Time. I feel like somebody like this critiquing our work today is really important because the only thing that matters on social media is going viral, and he does it a lot. <laughs> For today's challenge, <laughs> you will be Me working with the Hex Linzor, thank you. That, let's talk thank about these up. mystery boxes. Inside the boxes yes, are Jojo, props that you this. and your teammate will use to create a post that showcases the duality of the Twix brand and proves that there's more to a Twix. The team to magnify the power of inclusion in the most fun and engaging way will be the winner. Now we have randomly pre-selected the pairs and how you are selected will determine who gets to pick first. Let's start with our first team, Elva and Keith. Step right up. Uh -oh. Usually I'm not superstitious, but in this- Me and Vince are dying laughing because we know that, 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 that there's beef. Look, look at, they say that, look at me and Vince in the, in the right. <laughs> here, wait. Team, Elva and Keith. Look at us right, right here. Up. Usually I'm not <laughs> so in this particular situation. Yes, I think Keith first. The Keith curse is where when you're partnered up with Keith, Keith He's takes over the one. entire thing and makes it as Keith as possible and then wonders why we lose. Just put it away. Put it away. <laughs> you can choose <laughs> one. <laughs> Wisely. Oh my god. It's lagging a bit, y'all? Yeah? It's lagging? Oh, shut up. It's not lagging. Okay. <gasps> Reveal your prop. Wait. Wait, wait, let me watch this. Just put it away. Put it away. <laughs> you can one each and reveal your prop. Choose wisely. What is it? A genie lamp. Okay. <gasps> I think I remember this gorgeous. video. Oh my god. Oh. Wow. A bouquet Thanks, of flowers. Nice. Next Ooh. up is Eleanor and Vince. Oh my god. Oh, my god. Ooh. oh this yes. is about to be a crazy Vince episode. And Vince, finally. Oh, stop. Oh my oh. god. Toxic bottle, thank you for the sub. <laughs> Hello. Come on up, Kayla and Hugh. Awesome, girl. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh my god, that's so fun. They got crazy ones. Rubber ducky and crazy eight ball is insane. Yes, definitely. <laughs> and finally, Kitty and Carrington, come on yeah. up. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so unserious, bro. Yes, definitely. <laughs> and I like how I get to watch it with y'all, and I get to like pause it for all my students. Finally, Kitty and Carrington, come on yeah. up. Yeah. A basket. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Ooh. Yo, this is not let me tell y'all something right now, chat. I ate this sh up. Me, me, me and Kitty ate this sh up. Look at this. <laughs> I, I just wanted to say it's insane. I literally, I, I make the least brand friendly, safe content in the world. Not really. My content's not bad. 
But I make super not brand friendly sh online. Like I like smoke weed online. I wild out online. And then I do this show where they're like actually made me do all these brand deals. Y'all just look how this shit plays out. Just look how this plays we'll out. We'll make magic, don't worry. I can't wait to see what you guys come up with. Here's what I will be looking for in your post. post. Teams Jojo. post must highlight the importance of inclusion and how it's all about the and and not the or. The and. post must include Best both, of both mystery worlds. props from each team member. The post cannot be more than 30 seconds. You will have one hour to collect your I think Rossi is in here. 45 minutes to edit your posts. I, I can't wait to Hannah. see what you guys come up with. And remember that both members of the winning pair will get $1,000 in cash each. All right, good luck, you guys. Yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. For this brand challenge, I'm speculating and also guaranteeing <laughs> that I'll get my fifth win. <laughs> I'm speculating, I'm spectating, I'm also uh, predicting, and I'm also uh, hypothesizing, and I'm also guaranteeing as well. Yes, I would like to guarantee it as well. All right. Twix. Looks like we're okay. over here. You ready to get some work in? Thank you for the sub, Anna Schuler. Let's go over there. I'm so excited to hear your weird idea. Well, I don't, I, it needs work. It, okay. It's like okay, the beginning fine. of an idea. Okay. I'm thinking something maybe we could play with the yes and no, the magic eight ball, mm -hmm. and you can choose both sides. Yes. Maybe the chicken could be like the oracle or something, giving you a The nice oracle. <laughs> I feel like pretty comfortable around Kayla, and I feel like this challenge is bringing out more parts of me. <laughs> like instead of a human, is that yes? <laughs> and uh, chickens can have like spirits too. <laughs> I feel I love like you. the more. Hugh, you what are you talking about? I love it. We got a chicken and a magic eight ball, which is just like Alvin. Thank you for the gifted sub to Vince. <laughs> you selling a lot of bullshit. I don't. I was selling so much bullshit in the confessionals, y'all. I was like, you cannot catch me dead being mean or anything like that. All I was going to do every time I sat down and it was just me and the camera was, I'm going to be very nice to everyone else and I'm going to be an asshole about winning. That's what... <laughs> Come on, it's reality TV. Come on. And I imagined you as like the queen in this like castle. Okay, love. And then I'm like the jester. So it starts off. We both we're like we're like dating in the video and we're both call like on the phone like hey and it's like heart and it's like hey heart and we're using like these things and we're like as fun? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that's and then so cute. me and Kitty get along great. We have a similar sense of humor. She's super creative and a strong competitor and she's a lot of fun to work with. And then Toxic like, bottle, like, oh, thank I you. Go for to, this to, to something. I wanna go to the spot. I'm like, oh I wanna go on a picnic. And we're like, oh like we can't like like, well, where should we go? And we can't decide or something. And then we both surprise each other with you bring the pic a picnic basket and a robe, and I bring a robe, and then we're both having a picnic in our robes. So good! Yeah, yeah, we'll do that. comes idea. up with this idea of us basically planning a date. Um, I'm wanting a spa day, and he wants to do a picnic, and we meet in the middle, combining the and and not the or. I think it's so cute. But not really. No, it was a good idea. Yeah, it's really good. It's so cute. Yeah. Okay. Nine, okay, look, we ate that up. Guys, guys, when have you seen me not get out of a brand challenge, walk right to my team, and feed us the idea, and then we fucking eat, bro? I mean, Every time. Queen music. Mm -hmm. Like you know a boss. I mean? I'm about to stomp on Rossi's bitch ass. Have the power. Rossi, we're coming for blood. To trick this. <laughs> like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Vince and I write a script, which is like so not either of our working styles. Showcase pose have taught me a little bit that maybe it's it's better to plan, but it's very unlike us to be this organized. So we I ate make so sure many tricks that day. Exact, and that takes us a little while. Yo, that day I was literally on set, and they have like a thousand million tricks for us. And I was on set, I would pour a glass of hot coffee and dip my Twix in it and eat it. Oh, it was so good. The evil queen of Twixdom. <laughs> You're eating all the Twix. Mm -hmm. You get a call from your right hand man. Mm -hmm. The kingdom is in a shortage of Twix. It's in shambles. Only you can save this. Only me. Our concept is to have an evil queen who we rules love over Twixdom, and it's up to the advisor to convince her that she doesn't have to just be a selfish evil queen. She can be a queen, and she can be generous. You know, she can love her Twix and pass it along to everybody. Power of inclusion. We're hoping it's really funny. This we is love you, queen. This Saw is perfect. Twix. That's right, Aspen. Okay, cool. So what I'm thinking 
is that you are an archaeologist. Also, <laughs> starting off with you are an archaeologist is the most wilding shit I've ever heard on the show. These two things, the lamp and the <laughs> you break into some place that you've been trying to get in with a Twix That's in hand, good. obviously with the aid of Twix, and then you find the lamp, maybe it's on like a pile of Twix, right? It's surrounded by magic. You grab the lamp, you rub it, I come out, and I'm the Twix genie. And I grant wishes three. We have brand points and two props that we need to include, and we only have 30 seconds to tell Keith's archaeologist genie story. That makes no sense. <laughs> what do you think of it thus far? What do you yeah. think of it? Elba what are your thoughts? Doesn't really like me, which is fine. I don't really know why I could give you the Twix, and then we I don't get it like either. us enjoying the Twix together. Okay. We love Elva. Elva's so funny. I think she doesn't like my positivity. I think it makes her uncomfortable, but... I'm gonna stay positive. Maybe it does. I'm Maybe your do. positivity, yeah. So, I guess you'll have to work through it on this one. Go for it. To get started in data analytics, you don't need previous experience or a degree. The Google Data Analytics Certificate. Troll. Look at me with those damn painted nails. <laughs> Can you get the so, same shirt? Nah, shirt's a one-on-one. -on -one. And I have a magic eight ball that's going to read Hugh's future. So I make her a spell and I include all these different things. The final ingredient is a chicken. The chicken! And then we find out the answer all along was a Twix. This is funny as hell. <laughs> How's this look? Great. <laughs> With the basket, it's so funny. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna uh, take a All little right. test video, right and then now? you can tell me what you think of it. My first showcase post with Carrington was another bad date, so I think we are kind of in that same realm of on this like romantic little storyline path. We yeah, take we this, one. this. I, I was these. Okay. And then you have the basket. We ate this up, y'all. I see. Kittington, Kitty and Carrington, making their little cute picnic scene. Kitty they're definitely gonna utilize this little flirtation that they've got going on here. <laughs> they're wilding me out. Cute. You are hoarding our Twix. Yeah, no, that's Me and Kitty were winning some goddamn money. That's what we're going after. <laughs> Look at you. All right, let's go film. He was okay. our in perfect a funny way, deity of the stream. Staying uber positive and happy is like my own way of kind of counteracting Elva being grumpy. Like if she's gonna be that way, then- Keith, I think okay. you're making it worse. She doesn't have to be happy about it. <laughs> I think you're making it worse, Keith. I don't know. Almost over here, that way you're kind of like covering up the background. Getting to the house. Yeah. I still want to win, so I'm just letting Keith set up all the mm. shots, and then I'm just gonna try. They said, "Elva, you don't start being it. nice." I'm the Twix genie, and I grant wishes one, two, and three. Keith is so caught up in this three wishes thing when <laughs> we incorporate that Twix is two. What if there are two Keith wishes to funny, emphasize on two? I grant you wishes two. It's two. Not three, two. So why I don't know where the three came from either. Because Twix is two. I'll pop out of the lamp. And Do you want to say your... I'll say... Uh, Can we, you think we'll be able to hear them? Yeah. We've decided our whole video is going to be on green screen. So we need to utilize this space wholeheartedly, no distractions. Mm -hmm. What wish can I grant you, my lady? And then at that point... <laughs> you know, gonna... Why do they use the There's funniest clips for Keith? <laughs> And Keith, they I make you so funny like, in this. Oh God, are we gonna get the shots? <laughs> we need quiet. Them, huh? We need quiet. Yeah, it needs to be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yay! Oh Look my at my God. team. My team is always like shun sunshine and rainbows. So perfect, perfect, perfect. And now I'm gonna actually throw them. I'm <laughs> crying. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, she's wilding out. He was crazy. <laughs> like, she's so quiet every other time, but as soon as she, like, gets in the mode, she's loud. Please help me! Kayla was like, what the fuck are you doing? I thought I was the loudest person I know, but Hugh's on a whole nother level. Hugh, I love this side of you. Uh, let me go ahead and change. Yeah, we're done yes. in here. Thank you. Time's running out. We got to start editing. We are feeling very confident that we got every shot we needed. This is me and Eleanor's first time both using green screen exclusively for a challenge. So we're both a little intimidated. Ooh, the green screen. We did it. We did it. Now we just have to edit it. That's going to come together Yay. pretty quickly. Also, yeah. It's pretty much just like chronological editing. Mm -hmm. We can transfer over to my phone so mm -hmm. we can both edit. Get us both Get us both cut out of the frame so we can put, so we're both just like floating. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. I feel like Harrington has grown a lot. In the beginning of the competition, he had never downloaded editing software in his life. <laughs> yeah, that's what we want. Both of us, that's right? That's what we want, okay. yeah. Great. And now he's editing the craziest videos. Thank you, I can't even do that. Oh my God, come on. What the fuck did I Filming write on my hand? green screen was probably not the best idea. What did I write Harrington on my hand? is a little bit struggling because our cutouts aren't necessarily working. I am struggling to find the music for this. Hopefully we can finish in time. Man, we're not the whole video is crazy behavior. <laughs> it's totally crazy. What did I say? What the fuck? For this, hopefully. What did we I say? I'm just saying shit. Green screen the whole video is crazy behavior. <laughs> it's totally crazy. We have a honker of a story. Like there is a, a honker. And trimming this down is becoming a little tedious. I think whenever like you pop up as a genie, like you should put in, like, a little I'm magic sound. Sorry. Yeah. I think that's a great idea. Elba's really Who pitching in and helping. It's really nice to have a partner <laughs> who's really participating and helping. We're coming together, but I'm only doing it because I'm only doing it. Oh, that's so funny. So right now we're at a minute and 12 seconds. So we'll add to be down to 30, so we'll make it work. Oh, I think I got paid for a oh, short film I just did, or the yeah, movie yeah, I just did. My manager, yeah, right? I'm gonna respond right? to that. All right, guys, 30 more oh, minutes. Oh, We kind of got a boogie. Yeah, we do. Green screen is very inaccessible. Uh, it's not my type of content. It takes us a little bit of trial and error to like, you know, get the borders perfect and make it look really clean, but the time constraint is like killing us. So it's still like a minute and one. Okay, we can make How it. much are these damn brands paying yeah. for all this screen time? You're amazing at it, Kayla. How much do I need to play like, for a 30 minute section video. in a reality show to make a video about really me? Quirky. I'll do it. And funny and a little cheesy, but I think that it shows how Twix gives you the and instead of the or perfectly. They really milk these. Uh... Oh, here we go. That's so good. <laughs> good job. Good I'm job. very happy with this. All right. Well done, Elva. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Elf is like, oh, oh my god, that looks so good. <laughs> Wait. The pressure is on because I also know that me and Eleanor talk a, a lot of game. We wanted to. <laughs> we talk a lot of so shit, white boy! <laughs> a lot of shit! And. We talk more shit, though! Press it? Yes. Hell yeah, queen. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys! Hi! For this week's challenge, you were tasked with creating a video for Twix that highlights the power of inclusion. I'm so excited to take a look at all of these posts. And first up is... Judge Kitty me. and Carrington. Let's check it out. I look young. Hi. Hi. Spotted? Picnic? We did that last time. And? Meet me in an hour. Perfect. Picnic. And a spa day. Like one, like there's anybody who made a more adorable video than that, please. Bitch, please. Bitch, please. Yeah, I know the green screen looks bad. That's what makes it campy. You wouldn't understand. With your stupid ass. With your non-trendy ass. Everybody on TikTok, we're live on Twitch, Evil Carrington. I think that, y'all. 
Me and Kitty ate that shit up. We ate that shit up. Period. You two are such a power team. Aww. I feel like you guys just match each other on the same level of like comedic, fun energy. I really love that it was a lot of physical humor. I also love how you incorporated the product, like even using it as a phone. I loved it. I thought that was a great video. It was super relatable. I feel like I could go film that in my backyard if I wanted Yeah, it to. was, you know what it was? It was watchable. That was just organic. It was a watchable if video. If there was one thing that I wish you could have changed, it's just eating the Twix. But overall, the colors were good. The comedy factor was hilarious. And I love that. So overall, great video. Overall, Kitty, better than all your dumbass really nice videos. Job. It's so funny. My favorite part of their whole video is Carrington's legs. All right, next <laughs> up is Rossi, they give you Eleanor all the fucking speech out of the world. <laughs> Eleanor Sage, is that you, Eleanor? Hello. Your Majesty, there's a crisis in the Twixdom. There's a Twix. The candy and the cookie? Impossible. I believe the generous king would have shared his Twix with- With your double screen head ass. You're the queen and the one who can save us all. Don't you remember when all of Twixdom was happy and lived together in harmony? You're right. Can you talk about some damn Twix and quit talking about this damn man made up fantasy bullshit world that you're talking about with you and all this goddamn Twix, goddamn it? That and more. Twix for all. <laughs> I'm gonna be real, chat. They played that video and I thought I lost for sure. <laughs> they played that, I was like, oh no. Sianam, thank you for the sub. You know? That told such a story. I love that you guys knew what your concept was, and I wasn't confused as a viewer. You really incorporated it. It's got it a story, yeah, a fucking bedtime story. Yeah, there's a story. A story that'll put your ass to sleep with this goddamn Twix dump. Sorry, I don't know what the fuck that is. All of the little details. Even like having a ton with of your Twix stupid around ass. you. I felt that the brand integration. Oh, you guys thought that one was better? So All right. Naturally, with the overall concept. And Mopola I love seeing good. you guys team up together. Seattle. I thought the intro was amazing. Okay. It was eye captivating. The first three seconds, you pick up the phone. It's like, who, who's this person calling? So I Yo, was JoJo like, looks clean. If there was one thing I... JoJo just has a crispy look to him. He just looks crispy with that, with that emerald. With, with your silver emerald. Suggest you guys is just being a green little emerald on the nose. But overall, great video and it was super Yeah, it's funny. giving brand ad, exactly. It's giving brand ad. That's what I thought too. Be going. Eleanor and Vince's pose was amazing and everything was so well put together, like a lot of wordplay. And I thought it was like an excellent pose. All right, Keith and Elva, let's check out your pose. Yeah. yeah. Keith and Elva, here we go. Get your fucking America's Funniest Home Videos head ass. I'm the Twix Genie, and I grant wishes one and two. Bitch, please. <laughs> I'm not saying that to anyone. I'm saying uh, the Twix Genie. Bitch, please. Okay. One and two? Can you bring me two in? What are you doing here? Can you get us something that'll bring us together? Is that a Twix? Do you want to split it with me? Thank you for the Twix. I'm glad Twix could bring us together. <laughs> Chat, what the fuck was that? Chat, wait, I need to let I need to let in somebody to uh to to install uh this uh put blinds up in my room. Give me two seconds. I'll be right back. I need to actually like let this dude in the uh I need to let this dude in the house. Give me two seconds. BRV chat. just gonna be in here and the blinds are gonna be right here um so here here are the blinds you put it down i'll take care of okay it. awesome thank you and then these are both the windows they want to put up so i don't know i'll if probably I should... have to step on this bed. Yeah, yeah you can move whatever well then i mean my, my my room looks like shit right now but uh don't worry about it man uh can i get you a water or anything right now a little snack yeah yeah i got you thank you you, you want any, water basically any, yeah. are you hungry uh, if you have a little snack. A little snack? I got you right now. Thank you. My pleasure. Here's some nice little pop chips. You got nothing. Thank you. So much.
much other chips and stuff. So just let me know when you're hungry, all right, man? And I'm just going to be sitting right here. Don't worry about me, bro. I'll try to make it no. as close as possible. Do your thing, bro. Do your thing, bro. All right, we're back, chat. All right, here we go. Back with that lame-ass video next. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! I mean, honestly, I don't know what I was expecting, but I wasn't expecting that. I feel like you guys did such a good job. Like you incorporated the props so well, and I also love that you Bethany really Moda is so. Like it was so nice to see you guys. Like, Bethany Moda does a great job of hosting. Yeah. And I feel like but damn, so do they feed her some bullshit in those damn ears? Because yet. girl. And that vi that video that might as well fucking you might as well just kick them both off. I don't. <laughs> and I thought it was really well executed. I don't know. Good job. I thought the dynamic was amazing. You guys had me. The only thing that I wish was a little different was that lighting in the beginning. When you're scrolling through social media, that first three seconds is so important. No, guys, I Bethany doesn't lie for guys. Okay, let me, first of all, I'm just saying that me being a head ass, guys. Bethany is a great host and is doing so good at her job. Understand, y'all, this is reality television, and you need to, you know, you need to do some glazing. So that's that's what's happening. So no Bethany slander. No no slander of nobody. People, there are some funny people in the show, of course, um, but uh, no, no slander, okay? Right, I go. wish you guys just changed that part. You guys hit the brand points, and it was very fun to watch. I feel like Keith and Elva took the W. I'm like, these two are not friends. Their editing styles, their content styles, completely different. They had a great storyline. So I'm hoping this is the week that Keith finally takes it home. And finally, we have Kayla and Hugh. Let's check it out. What can I answer? This Will is you insane. Will and find love? Let's find out. That Will is insane. I got you, and I'll make a spell. And the most important ingredient. The chicken! Is this supposed to be a Twix ad? Sorry. Sorry, I'm I'm just not picking up. I thought they were making a Twix ad. I'm confused why it's been 39 seconds. All I've seen is a rubber ducky and a floating eight ball. Sorry. It has been here all oh, Twix. <laughs> I can have love and career. It's all about the and, and not the or. Uh. You know what's crazy, y'all, is I know how to do, like, all this, like, any fancy editing thing you guys are seeing, I know how to do, like, so easily now, and I'd still, like, editing is just so, uh, uh it's just, uh, you know what I mean? It feels like drama editing. Uh. Yeah. Uh. That was so good. Thank you. <laughs> That was so cool to see you guys team up. I feel like you both have such unique styles in what you do for your own brands. And it just like, it flowed together so well. I thought it was such a cool concept and you guys were super- I well. thought I didn't see the Twix once, um, but other than that, you know, I thought it was pretty okay. All uh, together, so good job. So first of all, the fact that you guys had a rubber chicken and an eight ball is a crazy <laughs> combination from, already. And combining it with Twix was just, you guys, you guys nailed it. You guys nailed the brand points, and I thought that was spectacular. Editing takes the video from you made this video and so can I to content. It, 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 when you make like a super edited content, I feel like it goes from like you're a person who makes videos and it's fun and it's casual and it's relatable to content. <laughs> That's how I feel, honestly. But sometimes I do it. But sometimes there's ways to like, you can make that content swag. But like, it just, I don't like when people take it so serious. Like, I don't know, take the work ethic serious, but don't like take the fucking, I'm a TikToker so serious. Not saying they're doing it, I do that if anything. But I'm just saying that the conversation around social media is just like, ah. Uh. to see. If I could make one tweak, I would put Hugh screaming in the very intro clip because I just feel like that would have been a lot more like captivating. The first three seconds, like I said, is the most important. Lighting, colors, all that stuff is so important. But oh Dude, crispy noodles. If I could just commentate on people's social medias, guys, you know how good I would be at that? At just like ripping shit apart? Oh my god. Overall, it was a great- But that's such like a weird position to be in because then you're just like a hater at that point. I'm not a hater. Video and you guys nailed the brand points super well.
I am blown away by Kayla's and Hugh's editing and the things that they had to incorporate together, a chicken and a magic eight ball, the fact that they were able to make that into a cohesive story is genuinely impressive. You guys, those were all such great posts, but there can only be one winner. So, Jojo, will you let us know who won this week's challenge? You guys, those posts were amazing and so fun. You guys all use the power of inclusion to show that there's more to a Twix. Coding boot camps require you to quit your job. What if you could earn income while learning how to code? This is K. But the team that has won this challenge is. The team that has won this challenge is. Carrington and Kitty. Oh. guest judges look at Carrington and they're like, he's so beautiful. I don't even need to watch the rest of the video. Like, give them the win because I can't think of any other explanation. I mean, their video is great, but how does he keep winning? Don't play. Do not play with me. Do not play with me. Do not. Because it will get wicked. It will get wicked. I will, I will, I will like, aggressively win every challenge so hard. Thank you for that. We love sugar. Thank you for those bits. Um, I'm the goat. Well done. Well done. It's unfortunate that <laughs> I haven't won one yet. You oh, got it, Keith. I, I believe in you. Um, <laughs> Congrats, you guys. You won. I can't wait till they let me talk my shit. I wonder if they put on it in. This week's challenge plus $1,000 in cash each. I came in this ah! thing and I said that I was going to win a bunch of brand challenges. And what's been happening? I'm a man of my words. And sadly, Jojo, it is word. time to say goodbye. Thank you for being with us yeah, today. Yeah, that's five Rackies. That's five Rackies so far. Thanks, guys. Super fun Thank being you. here. Thank you. Good luck. Have a good one, Jojo. Carrington, Vince, Keith, and Elba. You have all been eliminated from the competition. That means Kitty, Eleanor, Kayla, and Hugh, you will have until tomorrow to complete this week's showcase post. So good luck, and I will see you at elimination. Bye. Thank you very much. Bye. Thank you. Bye, Bethany. My concept for this week is to do another video about how much I love my skateboard. <laughs> Are we feeling nervous this week? I was nervous last week. I have like a rough idea, but I don't know. Everybody on Twitch, we are live on. I everybody on TikTok, like we're live on Twitch. Evil Carrington. Friend, and that's the premise. Funny. <laughs> I've been in the bottom a couple of times, and I don't feel fully confident in this. Yes, post, you glowing. He was always out. glowing. Do you have your shot list? Not at all. Like question mark. Do you like plan out a shot list already for your video or? No, but, well I know for a fact actually I'm gonna do the video with my mother, but I'm deciding on two different options. My concept for this week's showcase post is a video with my mom. Honestly, yeah, like she's my best friend. So like talking about. Everybody who's liking the show and wants to watch the other episodes, we're on episode seven. We have three more episodes of the season finale. I have been posting these on YouTube, uh, reacting to my reality show. Episodes one through six are out right now, just so y'all know. That. Paying a homage to her in a way, yeah. I wonder so if my mom's in the post reactions. this week because I miss her. And we just haven't had time to really connect in a while. I'm like, I'm wondering if I should do, maybe I should make a face chart for what I want to do for her makeup. Mm. Face chart is like when you like draw it out first before you do the mm -hmm. makeup? Like I'll show you. It's, they're very, very rough. Whoa. But, you know, my mom is my number one supporter. On the computer and she's is an crazy. incredible person. And she just deserves to know that she's appreciated and loved. I want to do a fun look on my yes, mom. Kayla. She loves red. Whatever she likes pink say, too. Ooh, Sounds a really good to me. Video. Oh, I'm excited to watch Thanks. that. Thanks. This is my favorite Hope look. Hope you yeah. feel better, Delia. Yeah, it's like, um, it's Whoa, a look at Ross's outfit. combines like all the stuff that you said to combine. They're so fashion so forward. Good. No, you helped me so much with this. Mm -hmm. You like held my hand through it. I'm happy to. I'm helping Kitty with her Kitty High 
yearbook. Show oh my god, stars. I remember talking okay, with ready? Rossi yeah. this day. I She's got a really strong Rossi vision for it, so I know that she is going to execute this really well. Oh my god, I remember speaking that was with good. Rossi. It's insane. Twix inspired me to show all the different sides of me. So Thank you, I'm Alvin. going to do a little breakfast club moment showing all the different versions of myself within a high school yearbook kind of vibe. Okay, I think you're done. Yay, Bye. good job. That was great. That was great. My sophomore year Rossi I won, Look most likely outfit. to make in Hollywood. So fun. They foreshadowed my whole life for real. You crashed. Oh my God, stop. Okay, so now you have... I'm literally eating so hard with this look. You have like an hour to edit the whole thing. Okay, yeah, that's enough time. I just You're want fine. to take one video of myself. Sure. I don't know if Let's anybody's take a picture noticed. Too. There's a common theme to my content. I have this high school nostalgia, fairy, ethereal essence. This is viral, I feel like. I swear to God, it was so good. Okay. All right, you got to add it. Where is it? Darkness, do you like my song? Today, I have to finish up filming and editing my post. Keith is helping me film with darkness and super helpful because it's really hard to move a plushie and like, Carrington? film it at the same time. Chad, you're I'm welcome. getting bored. I haven't okay. seen myself. Cool. Yeah, you got that done. Let me know if you need any more help. <laughs> okay. I should be good for a while. Chad, where the fuck am I? I'm scared to see everybody's videos, but I'm so nervous. I think every week, like literally, I have it's to be shocked like, by what? things going on. So I don't know. I you know. just don't know what's going to happen. Not even a little bit. Do you know what I mean? Oh, I do. I'm gonna do a showcase post all about being chronically ill. It's also something that's really relevant to me right now because at this point in the competition, like, put me in, I'm dog. like so tired. And if I were to get eliminated on a video now, it's like, well, obviously that would suck. I mean, I can't imagine you've been in the top every week. Wouldn't that be crazy? It would You're be just crazy. Like, goodbye. <laughs> I'm not somebody out, who really shares my struggles. I don't even like to share them with my family. So talking about Ehlers-Danlos, which is what I have, is not something I really do. I honestly am so proud of what I've put out here, though. Like, I, I feel like I've grown such an immense amount in terms of the things oh, yeah. I'm comfortable sharing and, like, yeah. the type of content I can create. I know. Ehlers-Danlos syndrome essentially means that my body doesn't produce collagen correctly. So around my joints, they're all kind of weak. I pretty much wake up every morning like this, just kind of crunched into a little ball, and then I have to like slowly bring my elbows down. Just because we're all so close now, like I, whoever it is, I, I'm sad about. You know what I, I mean? I know, dude. It's I like, know. Ah. My showcase post is the scariest thing I've ever created. It is. She's getting real out here. I'm most afraid to show to anybody. What's Carrington saying about any of this? In my entire time as a content creator, but I'm like really happy I'm pushing myself. Hey, mom. My mom is my mom is watching this. Mom, Rossi is from uh, Illinois. Chicago. Kitty's in here. This What's good, Kitty? Game. What the fuck is this? Oh. You're not. Can they put that Carrington time. in, bro? Final four feels so different. We are down to the wire. Damn. There's like a one Final in four, four chance crazy. that you could be eliminated today. I don't think I really feel much pressure this week because I think this is one of the best videos. Why does everyone look so fucking cool right now? Everyone has hoods up and shit. Everyone's like fucking black eye makeup, hoods on, like fucking scars on their face. What the fuck? I've ever made, like, period, and I just really love it, but who knows, I, I may still get eliminated. <laughs> I've been really so, <laughs> so cool, bro. Than I've Yo, Aspen, thank you for gifting that sub to Kitty. Like, I appreciate that, Aspen. So I'm taking a risk and doing something. Kitty, you have no more ads business now. Business thank you, like, Aspen. I feel good about it. Just say thank you, good. Aspen, in the chat. I feel chat. good. I feel, I just feel emotional, too, watching the video. I watched it a couple times, and I was just like, oh my god. <laughs> Ew, now I'm getting emotional. I really feel like I'm safe this week. I really feel like I am, but um, you honestly never know. <sighs> All right, guys, here we go. I'm getting used to this somehow, but it's still scary every time. <laughs> God bless, thank <laughs> we'll you. We'll see man. what happens, Ed. Here we go. 
Now that the right, showcase posts have been uploaded, the industry experts I was like, who the fuck is that? That's will her determine mom. who stays and who goes. The influencer with the lowest yes. votes this week could be eliminated from the competition. Go influencer. <laughs> Guys, I'm, I'm gonna be Oh my god. Wait, 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 chat. Can I just say something right now? This was my this is one of my like my second or third weeks. I still haven't watched the whole season. Reliving it so hard, Kitty. I haven't seen it either. This is my first time watching it too. Um, I uh, I remember being in the in the lounge where like where the the four go to like do their little challenge, and then like we're in like the loser lounge. I can't even explain how funny that was. Sometimes I literally cannot explain. Maybe they keep it in y'all, but I was laughing really hard during this lounge. Ow, oh, fuck. But but you'll but maybe you'll see. I don't know. I like this music. Hi everyone. Hi. Well, we are Ooh, now. The girls are eating right now. All the girls look great. In this competition. Last week, Elva was eliminated by look the at all y'all look amazing versus game online community and is now in the creators lounge with the other eliminated players. Tonight Dog, oh my god, wait, wait. Wait, you can just like community. see and is now eliminated by the contestants left in this competition. Last week, Elva was eliminated by the industry experts and versus game online community and is now in the creators lounge with the Look at me, I'm laughing. You guys see, guys, look at me, look at me like laughing at this shit. The other eliminated players. <laughs> Tonight, one of you will- I was cracking up, bro. Be ...joining them, but still with a chance to get back in the game. But it's gonna get posted get on YouTube started, probably tomorrow. Let's check in on them in the creator's lounge. Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, hey, Bethany. Hey, Bethany. All right, we'll check back with you later. Rossi has a new outfit every day. Now this week day. you worked with Twix and our special guest judge, Jojo Sim. You got to create some amazing content that highlighted inclusion and embraced the world of and. All right, pick but this now up. the go. goal is to take the social media skills and other brand building tips you've learned this week Thank and you, put Alvin, them I'll to work that. in creating your showcase posts. So before we get into this week's showcase posts, I have a couple of questions for the group. Kitty. Hi. Hi. You won this week's Twix challenge. Kitty Congrats. looks stylish. Thank you. Kitty looks yeah. cool. So what was it like working with Twix? Oh, it was so nice to work with Twix. I grew up on that candy. I love the cookie, the caramel, the chocolate. It's so good. It was so nice to create something with the I candy, like the, the chocolate. Or. Yes, I love it. All right, Kayla. Hey. You were teamed with Hugh for the Twitch Yes, challenge. everyone gas up Kitty. She's in the chat. Her. Tell her how much you like her outfit, guys. I learned that Hugh is a Tell ball her she's of energy. Slaying and she's <laughs> eating Literally, and when we down. were trying to figure out what Mamas. to do, she was like, can we make it more dramatic? And she went fully into character. It was a nice side of Hugh. I loved it. Mm -hmm. Eleanor. Hello. So talk to me about the pressure of being challenged to create such specific content in such a short time span. Oh my God. This is like pressure that we've never felt. I know we're all so They were going hard. With these. It's crazy because my mind is still things. like so excited to create. I feel more oh, mentally right inspired now, than I've ever been. But like, my body is breaking down, girl. Eleanor was going hard. I'm losing sleep over this. I know we all are. You know, we all care so much. And this is, this is a completely different type of pressure yes. cooker than anything we do in our own self-produced content. So it's it's a journey. Can you put me in? <laughs> All right, Hugh. Hi. You haven't really strayed from making so cool. skateboarding content. What keeps you so dedicated to that? Mm, I would say for me, I just feel like it's a sense of knowing. Y'all can all follow Kitty on all of her social medias. It's like Kitty Lever, you see her in the chat. Those are all her usernames for her Instagram and TikTok as well, I think. When I found it, it's just what Same I want to do with Vintrasi, my life, so all in. All these people. Love it. All right, so here's the deal. As we move forward, each challenge on this journey will push you to become better content creators. And now it's all about the showcase post. This is where you took anything you learned this week or not and made an original piece of content that has been shared with our industry experts yeah, and kidding. versus game universe. 
Well, the results are now in as we go down from four to three players. And the contestant with the lowest ranking this week I is do being ask eliminated them. from the competition. All right, everybody ready to get into it? Missy Kitty. Oh, yes, let's yeah. do it. <laughs> so after seeing each of your videos, I will tell you if you are in the- Everybody hitting me up about emails, send them to, to Deadfish's email. Don't send me the emails anymore, y'all. Send all the thumbnails to- The top two or in the bottom Deadfish. two this week. And then one person on the chopping block will be eliminated from the competition and join the other eliminated players in the creator's lounge. Your fans have spoken, and I'm gonna start with Kayla. Kayla, you ready? I am ready. You've grown Ooh, so much amazing, as a content creator so throughout much. this competition. So what great. would you say you. is driving you? That's my mom. <laughs> Making my mom, oh, my yeah, family in general proud is oh, yeah. my biggest force of inspiration and motivation, definitely. Well, I'm so excited to see your showcase post this week, so let's take a look. My mother is not only my best friend, but my greatest role model. Born to two immigrant parents, my mommy, Abigail, inherited the burden of expectation. She was expected to work hard and be better than her parents and all those that grace this earth before her. She was tasked with excelling beyond her ancestors, and I can say with absolute certainty, she has made them proud with all she has accomplished. Yes, Outside girl. of her many achievements, my mother has a heart of gold. And with this gift, she chooses to make any person she meets feel like their home. With one look and one smile and one word, she can make a stranger a friend and a friend a family. She is the most kind-hearted and compassionate woman I know, and I'm so lucky to call her not only my mother, but my best friend in this wow, life. Wow, she and looks smashed right now. She looks great. <laughs> literally crying um kayla thank you thank you so much for for sharing that um i'm i can't imagine Bethany what Boda that meant crying. to you to do that Quit and playing. include your mom and i'm sure it meant so, so much to sad. your mom as well that you put her on that pedestal and you you spotlighted her and you gave her her moment i thought that was so beautiful everything you said about her her beauty and her spirit was like shining oh through God. that video like i have chills it's so beautiful i think you're so creative you have such a beautiful heart I'm so god kayla's so funny this girl's so funny Kayla just comes off as like so many cool, nice girl. Dog, Kayla's so funny. That girl is so the girl's video we just watched, y'all, she is like actually like for real funny, dude. People and you're gonna help. Like she will have me like you know what I mean? So many more, and that was so beautiful. Thank you. Every well, on TikTok, we're live on Twitch, this. Evil Carrington. You are not in the top two this week. You are on the chopping block. Next up, let's talk to Eleanor. <coughs> Hi. All right, you ready to get into it, Eleanor? I don't know. Yeah, I'm ready, I'm ready. You have such a distinct, beautiful style. How do you feel that your content has really evolved in All this right, competition? All right, Joe, you gotta show my reactions yeah. or something. I'm opening I don't up really know the things that here. I think before the competition, I would have been like, that's going nowhere. Like, that's my business. Now I'm just starting to recognize, like, that's how I can connect with people and that those are really the things that are worth sharing. Um, and they don't, they don't feel scary being around other people who are willing to do the same thing. Mm -hmm. Well, let's take a look at your showcase post. Here we go. Having a chronic illness means the body you love sometimes fails to love you back. It's a constant fear of physically falling apart. It's time never quite on your side. It's limbs creating geometric forms and goblin fingers adventuring in the night just to curse you in the morning. It's skin, soft, fleshy, a bit too stretchy skin. And in life, it's constant readjustments. But what a beautiful thing to grow old with knees that endlessly, bafflingly support you, like Atlas with the world, for your outer shell to be so delicate, but so strong, constantly regenerating, closing the gap that separates your soul Eleanor from the just eats everything world, up, bro. For hands that hug your family and draw your Eleanor, heart, I'm out here making, like, fucking... In the daytime everyone's out here making TikToks. Eleanor's out here and moving me and right shit. To have this body at all. Oh, that's not enough. 
Eleanor. Eleanor's out here just making everybody just Whoa. just just dicking on everyone out, dude. There's Eleanor's so many amazing. Things to say. I feel like you've showed us. So I know much she's of your so sweet. She's the best. How creative you are, and how you can take a concept and just turn it into something like she eats. even more it's magical like, right. than it already was. Your post this week. Eat it up. Just you eat it somehow up. topped on. everything so else you've up. already done. Like I think visually it was stunning. There were so many also like plain yeah. words that you used. You're such a beautiful writer. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I loved the way you described honoring our human experience and and even our bodies, which we can be so critical of. And it was your way of showing. Here we go, chat. Lock in. Here we go. Why is my camera so damn zesty cam right now? Showing respect to who you yeah, are you and the fact that right. you're here and we're all here together. And I just felt this love through your content. I'm so it made me also appreciate my human experience as well. And everything down to like the way you use the flowers and hey, like you on, did so me, many girl. little come intricate on. details wow. that kept me so interested. Wow. And I feel like I learned more about myself. I don't mean to be annoying, but like, wow. and wow. I really connected wow. to you. I thought it was stunning. Thank you so much. Thank so you. Nice. Well, Eleanor. Yo, Eleanor, we get it. You're the better at this is, than everyone. Are you on the <laughs> Eleanor's the best. Eleanor's the best. And I can tell you that your results. What is he saying? Hey, you just ate everyone up. Come back. Fuck you. Oh. <laughs> yeah, great videos, but I wonder what Karen keeps thinking again. This damn Follow Me TV show probably learned I can make some money from these damn ad placements because I have not never seen that many of these ads. Welcome back to Follow Me. All right, Eleanor, I owe you some results. <laughs> well, I think your post was amazing, but what counts are the rankings. And you are safe. You made it to the top two this week. Yes, Congrats. girl, we got it, yes. All right, Hugh, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Are you a little nervous? How are you feeling? I feel nervous. Okay. <laughs> So, Hugh, what would it mean to you to win this JD, contest? thank you for the sub, JD. I, I appreciate it. it. Would thank mean you so to me much. Like, uh, validation that I'm probably on the right path with life and what I choose to do on this journey. Like yeah. what, Kitty? All right, Hugh, well, let's take a look <coughs> at your showcase post. W, JD, Juice. I am darkness and light, Ooh. chaos and order. Combat. She's fierce right now. And I love the way it can make me feel. Baby, I love you. Until the end of time, forever you'll be mine. Wish our love will last forever and never ever ever stop. You poor again of you, the way you make me feel. It's you that I adore. I'm so bad that I want more. Why do I love a sleeper? What the fuck is going on? Am I crazy? She made a song. Why is this like new information? Hugh's actually like the stream princess. We love you. It snaps. Did someone just ask me if Nightphone is actually me? Really? Yeah, it is me. Okay, effects. Okay, editing. That was so cool. Okay, I feel like you editing. had so many awesome visuals in there. A lot of it, I was like, how? <coughs> like, how did she even do that? I would not be able to replicate that in any way, shape, or form. I loved the overall vibe of it. I love that you did like a song and you did like a whole music bit. I thought it was super fun, super high energy. I feel like it allowed you to stay true to who you are while also giving us something a little bit different. And we could see that you're really switching it up week by week. So props to you for really elevating your content and giving us something new. I thought it was great. Thank you. So good. Now this competition continues to be very tight from week to week. 
Did the voters put you in the top two or the bottom two on the chopping block? Night what do you think, is so you? good. Thanks, y'all. Uh, I'm not sure because it's kind of always unexpected for me, so... Night yeah, phone is so stuck like in y'all's heads. That's awesome. <laughs> Yo, also, I don't know if M is in here, but M made an edit of me to Night Phone, and it has like 400k views. I'm like, what? Y'all like that song? Dang, people like my music. What the heck? Well, before I can tell you if you are safe These or girls not, are so precious. These girls are the most precious. And they're even more sweet and delightful Katie, in real life. Are you ready? I'm ready! <laughs> now, through this experience, what do you feel like you've learned most about yourself? Hey, what I've learned most about Big myself dog. is that I'm Let me like. Pause this. What's going on? All good to go? All set. Amazing, dude. Thank I you so both much. Both of the remotes, one here and one there. Okay. Like it's, uh, and what do we do with the, the cords? If you want to charge it, sometimes it needs to be charged. Oh, interesting. It's USB. Interesting. You just plug it into the wall. You plug it into anywhere and it works. Okay, that, that's you spectacular. Can take it off. Okay. I left it on just for you to see it. Okay. But you can always like take it off. It's a. USB, it's a Seaport. Okay. All right. Awesome. Thank you so much for that. I, I really appreciate your help. Can I get you a water or anything before you head oh, out? Good. You sure? Yeah, I haven't drank the, uh, the other one. Okay. All right. Well, dude, thank you so much. So much appreciate it, brother. Appreciate you, man. Thank you so much for mm -hmm. coming today. Really appreciate it. And uh, you have a great rest of your day, man. Thanks so much. You need anything else, okay? Absolutely. Thank you again. All right. Back on chat. Here we go. 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 Constantly innovating and creating new ideas and to follow my heart and go in that direction And I'm learning that I can just create whatever's in my brain and it's so so fun Yes <laughs> Pulling it out All right, Kitty. Let's take a look at your showcase go. post ah! Okay <laughs> Yeah, Kitty Kitty the high advice I never Kitty what the hell is that font? One thing. Because that to be silly ass font is to be the jock who learned all about life with a ball at her feet yeah, I was a Division One soccer player. Traded my clock it, clock it, D one. My cleats first. Clock it, D one, Adidas. Heels and became probably. a model in New York City. Clock well versed it. in Barbie hands and runway walks. I'm not being rude, There's Kitty. Internal nerd. I'm glazing. Has her library card and hates to admit she got a 4.0 in high school. And college. Oh, weird to your font. Then there's the tortured artist who pulls all-nighters writing poetry and sews her clothes. Yes. I play each role in my own coming-of-age movie because to fully live is to embrace every single part about you. There are so many versions of yourself, so let this be the best advice you ever took. Be everything. Yes, girl. She, you're just like you should be in like a cool vamp. Uh, okay, cool I love Concept. I love that you kind of went with like giving us advice in such a cool creative way I also really love that you showed us like all these Kitty sides of who slays. you are Love the message and Kitty one so thing throughout this competition is I feel like you just have you such shit. incredible taste and such a creative eye Even showing us like your clothing that you make and all of this stuff I think it was such a great way to show that you can have your hands in lots of different areas. You can yes, try girl. lots of different things. And that's what woman. I love about you because you so confidently can dabble into everything. I really loved the over overall concept with the visuals and like the school aspect of it all. I thought the editing was super cute. Oh, thank you. And more importantly, I just loved seeing you. And I've loved- My mom is in here. My mom just says, get haters off chat. Tracy, do you know- do you even know what that means? <laughs> she said chat? My mom saying chat is insane. Mom, I love you so much. Thanks for watching. Seeing you throughout this entire competition. Thank so, good you. job. Thank you, thank Kitty you. Kitty would slay a horror film. Okay, She's we an are already split. Eleanor is in the top half and Kayla is on the chopping block. Now it will either be Hugh or Kitty joining Kayla tonight for elimination. The player oh, who is safe is Gonna be revealed when we come back. Come on, put me in, coach. Get haters off chat. Hi, we're visible. Getting set yeah. to travel this summer and need yeah, a wireless but, plan that'll on, keep bro. you connected. We're going crazy with these ads. Welcome back to Follow Me. Yes, I did. I did. We've uh, seen our competitors another, uh, give it their uh, all. I did this a comedy, week. Kitty. They've worked with That's experts, good. celebrities, and of course, Second got movie. the once in a lifetime chance to work with Twix. They've made amazing content already, but now it comes down to this. 
Each of you have uploaded your 45 second showcase post to our industry experts and versus game platform. And the results are in. Hugh, Kitty, you block. one of you is going to the chopping block right now. And it is Hugh. Thanks, Kitty. Kitty, you have made the top Damn two you. and you are safe. Damn, so And Kitty, not only are you safe, your climb through the rankings is some of the biggest that we've seen. What? Whoa. Well, they're glazing right now. All what right. are they glazing In on the her? bottom half, we have Kayla and Hugh on the chopping block. You ready to know who's being eliminated? No. Well, we are about wow. to find out. Uh... Hugh, Kayla, it is time. The person oh being eliminated tonight is oh God. Kayla. That means Hugh, you are still in the God competition. Shit. Now, Kayla, damn, even on the you mom video, there's still a chance for you to get oh, back. Oh, she the game. not happy. Moving forward, you will be able to participate in the challenges, oh, but for now, we will not we see you do Kayla. any more showcase posts. Kayla was eating everything up. She was doing so good, dude. Finale, one and of our that mom video. players will be voted back into the competition, so anything can happen. And one of these remaining competitors will become the Follow Me Season 2 champion, and they'll walk out of here $50,000 richer. Thank you, players. Oh Thank you, Twix. I'm Bethany Moda, and I will see you on the next episode of Follow Me. That was episode seven of Follow Me. Holy shit, guys. Holy sh